I don't know. Well, most of us were asleep last night if you're working this early morning shift, but look at our sky last night. The northern lights were visible in North Texas. This picture sent in by Kay and Sanger. We also had some really pretty colors coming out of Lake Texoma. This one sent in from Lori. You can still see the stars as well. And a few more pictures being sent in just from all across North Texas. This one added Chico from Anna, but a lot of these pictures, you can see the pink hues in the sky. Those are the northern lights. So let's talk about what causes the northern lights because this can actually be forecasted within a few hours. It originates from the sun. The sun has sunspots and from those sunspots, solar storms kind of originate. That's what uh, the solar storms are basically charged particles that get pushed towards the earth, generally at around 1 million miles per hour. Uh, and these ions generally bounce off of our protective magnetic field. However, there are some weaknesses in our magnetic field at the North and the South Poles, and those ions generally do tend to find those weaknesses and sink into the Earth's atmosphere. That's why the Northern Lights are seen most often near the North Pole. Now, electrons that get through encounter oxygen and nitrogen in the atmosphere, and those interactions said do give off the form of energy that we see as light uh, and the color of the light actually depends on the height that the oxygen and nitrogen interactions are occurring. So what we know is that the peak of this solar storm happens today at midday. We can't see it because the sun is fully out at that point. However, this solar storm is strong enough to where you could still see at moderate viewing across areas of the middle of the country. And I do think, Mark, that we could see some of the sol uh, of the northern lights again tonight. Uh, the visibility is going to be low, but definitely want to make sure to look up sometimes on your camera. Mm. If you take a picture, you can see it a little bit easier. Is there a certain time we should kind of keep our eyes open? You know, any time between I would say eight and around midnight and look towards the north, make sure your eyes are outside for a little bit so that you can adjust uh, your viewing.